Hello everybody. So today I wanted to share with you how you can turn off the news and interest on your Windows 10 taskbar. Maybe you don't want to see the weather popping up or see news articles that are showing up. I'm going to show you how you can remove it and also how you can adjust those settings. So let's go over to the computer now and I'll show you all those steps. Okay. So I have my Windows 10 computer pulled up, and if you'll notice in the bottom right corner, down here on the taskbar, I have the news and interest section. Well, maybe you don't want to have that show up at all. How can you get rid of that? Well, there's two ways that you can remove it if you don't want to have it at all. So the first way is I'm going to move over to this section right here where there's nothing and I'm going to right click and I'm going to go to news and interest and you can just tell it to turn off completely. So you can either show the icon in text or you can show an icon only or you can just turn it off entirely. So if I turn it off, now that section is completely gone. But if I go back and I right click and I go back to news and interest, and I say show icon only, now you can see there's a little cloud right there. And if I hover over the cloud, it'll show me the news and interest. It'll pop it up so that I can see it. But if you don't want to have it where you hover over it and it pulls up, you can fix that too. What you can do is you can right click on the taskbar, go to news and interest, and then where it says open on hover, if you turn that off, if I hover over the cloud, now it shows me the news and interest. Now, if I clicked on it, it will show me the news and interest. But if I just hover over it like I am right now, now it's not going to pull it up because I turned off the open on hover feature. Now, if I right click again and I go back to news and interest, I can turn on the open on hover. And there's also one other feature you may like. If you right click on the taskbar and you go back to news and interest, you can reduce the taskbar updates, meaning it won't update as frequently. It won't give you the update on the weather. It won't give you the update on the stocks as frequently. It won't give you the updates on the articles. So it would just update less frequently. It wouldn't use as much of your data if you were limited on the amount of data that you had for your internet connection. But I don't want to reduce it. I'm going to leave it on. And you can also go ahead and turn it back where it has the icon and the text. So it'll tell you that it's 72 degrees and it's cloudy outside. And then, of course, if I hover over it, it'll pull it up as well. Now, there is another way that you can pull it up too. If you right click on the taskbar and you go to taskbar settings, this also opens the same options that we just saw. If I scroll to the bottom, here is the news and interest section. So I can turn off the news and interest on the taskbar completely. If I just slide it over to off, now it's completely gone. But if I turn it back on, you can do the same settings we just did on the taskbar. You can have either the icon and text or the icon only. And then you can either hover to open the news and interest from the taskbar. You can leave that on or you can turn it off. And then you can also reduce the updates to the news and interest on the taskbar. And you can turn that on or turn it off. Now, I'm going to leave it the default way because I do like it. At times, it's very helpful to see the stocks, to see the weather. So I'm going to leave it like that. But if you wanted to turn it off, that's how you would go and turn it off on Windows 10. So I hope that was helpful on how you can either remove or adjust your Windows 10 news and interest section that shows up on the taskbar. If you do have any questions about this, or maybe you just need me to go into more depth about it, please let me know down below in the comments and I will do my best to get back to you. And if there's a video, topic, article, anything that you'd like me to make a video on, please let me know that down below in the comments as well. And I will do my best to create that video for you. And if you found this helpful and you'd like to support this channel, 
I left a link in the video description where you can buy me a cup of coffee if you'd like to. And as always, because you all do such a great job, if you can hit that like and subscribe button so I can keep putting up more great content like how do I remove my news and interest section on the Windows 10 taskbar? And I'll be more than happy to keep sharing all this great content with you all. Thanks so much, everybody. I really appreciate you all. I hope you have a great day. Take care. God bless. And I'll see you all next time. Bye.